Welcome back to another App Daily News 5-minute video with a hockey coach Go called Frenchy. Today, we want to talk about the mock trade proposal for the Montreal Canadian and the review game between the Oilers and the Montreal Canadian. First of all, the Montreal Canadian last part of score 2 1 in overtime. Evan Bouchard scored on the power play during the overtime when Mike Madison was at the penalty box. Great effort overall by the Montreal Canadian. I really like their performance. Again, the Oilers, when you consider their performance earlier during the week, again, the Flowers and the Sun Jacks, we have to be proud of what Montreal did against the Oilers. This was the first game for Joshua Roy. I think overall he played a very good game. He was on the line with Sean Manin and Joel Armia. Cole Caulfield scored his 12 goal of the season and power play, and he shot seven times on Stuart Skinner, the goaltender of the Edmonton Oilers. Uh, Matwaganian did another thing very well. They shut down Connor McDavid. McDavid have only one shot during the game. He have only one point, and his assist came during a four versus three during the overtime. We have to give credit of the performance of Nick Zuski to cover McDavid and the first line. And also, the two defensemen was always on the eyes of one McDavid was. It was Keenan Cooley and Mike Madison. Obviously, the end split was not good for the Montreal Canadiens. One of the reasons the Montreal Canadiens lost this game, I think, is the end split with five penalties during that game. And then, we have to review the controversy goal from the Oilers to tie the game at the beginning of the third period. Martin Sidoui saw possible an interference. And then, obviously, the referee did not disallow really? the goal and give the goal to others to tie the game one to one and that's pretty much what happened during the game uh, Samuel Montembeau uh, did another great performance for the Montreal Canadiens with a save percentage of 9-5-1 phrase to others uh, final score Edmonton 2 and the Montreal Canadiens 1 next game Monday night the Montreal Canadiens owes the Colorado Avalanche and Nathan McKinnon finally my last subject of the day is about the mock trade proposal and during the next couple of weeks we're going to create more mock trade proposal because the trade deadline is approximately seven weeks from today first of all this trade proposal again is a montreal canadian and colorado avalanche why they have a great relationship between colorado and the montreal canadian they trade twice in the last couple of years remember the trade from arthur lekanen for justin Barron today I send Sean Manin to the Colorado Avalanche, and my proposal is Sean Manin with Jonathan Kovacevic get and return the first round pick of the Colorado Avalanche in 2024, the third round pick in 2025, and also the Avalanche prospect Alex Bocage. Bocage a draft a 78 overall pick by the Colorado Avalanche in 2019, the 6th. 190 pounds, right winger, played right now with the Colorado Eagles in the American Hockey League. In 21 games, he has one goal, six assists for a total of seven points. And of course, uh, he could be a good asset for the Laval Rocket in the future. This concludes my mock trade proposal. Sean Manin and Jonathan Kovacevic to the Colorado Avalanche and return the first one pick 2024, the third one pick 2025, and the prospect Alex Bocage. That's conclude all the subjects we have on this episode. Thanks for watching another App Daily News 5 Minutes with Hockey Coach Google Friendship. But before we leave, we invite you, don't forget to click on the like, subscribe, and leave us a comment about the game between the Montreal and the Oilers or the mock trade proposal today we got for the Montreal Canadian. Until the next time, we want to remind you, you have greatness inside of you, and we wish you an amazing, great, blessed day, everybody.